Yo! Yo! Ball's really slow. Yo! <laughs> Wait, Ball's really slow in this. Okay. Well, um, I honestly don't know where to start on the tier list. There's a, I should, I should have a tier for all of the, <laughs> I should have a parasite tier and make a one, make one that is just straight up annoying. No. For edibility, parasite. This is the parasite tier. I doubt they'd be tasting any good. Yeah. Add a row below. Um, Nintendo. Just Nintendo Switch cartridge. Right. Um, all of the rival tech nice. goes into the Nintendo Switch cartridge, um, because it's rival tech. But down the road, down the road. Let's hmm? see what I. You're you're missing two of them. There we go. I'm I'm missing a nemesis, but that nemesis gets his own tier. It's I the suppose. nemesis. I see the nemesis. Uh, parasites also get their own tier. Um, I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend eating them. Um, Can I eat them? I wouldn't recommend eating them. The curse sites as well. Them? Curse site is highly radioactive. Um, therefore, you should avoid at all costs. But I it does taste like chicken. For an oppressor in there. Um, <laughs> why did I? Oh, and and the actual parasite itself, um, and and all of these pussy rock pox. Bro, don't we eat love rock pox. pox. You don't eat rock pox. I would not recommend rock pox. I would recommend. Um, and then here we're left with the everything else. Honestly. What should I put the Ebonite ones as well? Because they're kind, they're kind of, they're kind of Ebonites. They have a very hard exterior. Honestly, they're kind of, kind of, kind of A tier. I, I, I kind of believe that once you get past that outside, you get something like a, like a durian on the inside. Like a tasty. <laughs> tasty, tasty durian. Um, Imposter. I'll change this to inedible tier. Um, so that I can put the exploders in here, because um, if you try to cook them, um, surprise! Um, oh, I can't put the radioactive exploders and radioactive uh, glyphids in here. I would put the Praetorian in here as well. We need, it's... You need to put. You need to, you need to make a tier for uh, kidnappers. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, Cave leeches that's... and shit like that that kidnaps you. But this, this is this is for the edibility of all these creatures, though. Oh, you're supposed to eat them? Yeah, yeah, this is how they are to eat. Bro, bulk detonator at the top. Uh, I, I would Easy. assume that you can't cook. I mean, you know what? No, bulk detonators, that, the bulk detonators, that, that can, you, can, you can torch them. Honestly? Kind of a nest here. The, the cr crashes one is a bit lower, um, a bit more grainy on the inside. Punch your mouth gold. <laughs> Um. Yeah, but if you want golden teeth, definitely, definitely go go for the golden bulk detonator, the crashes. Um, over <laughs> over the normal bulk detonator. If if you guys have any other thoughts or or feel like this this tier list is wrong, please do tell me. Because <laughs> this is all just me right now. <laughs> um. Honestly. I have a feeling the the acid's better. A Li little bit tangy. A little bit tangy. Not enough. Not 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 much meat. Very a lean too much acid. and very tangy. Yeah, exactly. Um, where's the set? Are the setic spreaders here? Yeah, they're 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 solid D tier. All they do is shit. They're like You're like eighty ninety nine percent of their body is shit. Oh, Blaziken. The rest but of it. The rest of it is just this hard exco exco. Esco ex exoskeleton, there we go. Excuses. <laughs> Damn. Um you know, Glyphids Glyphids probably probably would be like a solid B at middle of the road. Juicy um But not too back. tender. Yeah, exactly. Um 
In fact, no, probably C because I'll put I'll put Glyphit guards in B tier. They, like I, I, they gave me kind of lobster flesh vibes. And hello, bro. Crack them open to eat them. Crab and you lobster. Give me lobster flesh. Yeah, exactly. Um, oh, Rick, I'm, I am I, I am doing I'm the doing. edibility tier list. <laughs> I'll join you once I'm done eating chips. Um, How edible are they? I think we we can save the dreadnoughts for last. These are these are these are dreadnoughts. Um, <laughs> honestly, these wasp net, yeah. Um, okay, That's let's good. just bring this back up. So honestly, with the um, sandblasted wasps, can I ask you a question? Probably would be D tier. No, you can't, Rook. What? The bulk detonator. Yep. Why F tier? Um, they taste because good. I would I would imagine. Um. Firstly, you can you can in fact hit them with a flamethrower, and they won't immediately explode, unlike the normal normal um, exploders. Uh, secondly, like it's it's just got this exotic flavor, and you are like it's like a puffer fish, right? It's not See, good, but you have a chance of dying. This is why I have an issue with this. The gold nature should just be fancier, more expensive, so it should be assessed. Yeah, but see. I just think it, it has more grainier good. texture due to due to the crashiness, the gold. Okay. Okay. Even though they are rarer. Um, but if you like gold teeth, as we said, that's perfect. Honestly, the ho hollow bow nests probably closer to bee nests, which pretty good honey. What kind of vibes do cave leeches give you? Lobster. Really? I'm I'm imagining some sashimi -tier. tuna. Oh B yeah, B tier. Yeah. You have to work you have to work for it. You have to not die by leech. I personally think I ate it. Hmm. I I just I just Hmm. Maybe. We're saving. We're saving the SS tier for, for for something. I don't know what that thing might be. It might just be the best thing on the list. What about these? You know. You know what these swarmers are. They're like um, little little shrimps, little prawns. And you just eat them whole. Or have you seen those crabs that you just eat them whole? Small small crabs. You mean the soft shell crab or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like there's those really small ones that fit yeah, between you your fingers. Yeah, uh, you just fry a pole and then cut them. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, what I, I haven't eaten them, but they look fucking delicious. Yeah, exactly. They're, they're really sweet. Honestly, S tier borderline SS. I think. Avoiding everything. With Delgat caught in your teeth, A tier. That's, that's fair. I'm moving it down a bit. <laughs> um, what about the menaces? I presume the only... Like, the only good part would be those cheeks. Those weak Wait, spot cheeks. I see them being a knife steak. Really? Yeah. I, pre I presume you a get so much... A knife bitchy steak. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking this is going to be high. Because you, you have those really big cheeks that just... Seem like they're filled with something, some sweet I meat. Between A and B. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm. Mm. Huh? Honestly, A. Um, let's let's also move the presses to the back of the list. We can tackle those later. Um, Praetorians, however, we were speaking earlier about um. How juicy their their behind looks. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I think we could reference that uh, radioactiveness for hot spicy. So. Oh yeah, yeah kind of kind of like this wasabi for... kick, isn't it? Yeah. So no, 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 no. Like a like a normal jalapeno or some shit. But pretty good. It's so bad and actually hot you. So maybe. It's like the most spiciest food. Don't like, like so, like you're... a death week or whatever they're called. So maybe they're too spicy. I honestly, I don't, I don't think slashes are that good. They, they, they just seem like uh, normal glyphids with 
more spikes. That's it. Weave your mono oh, eyes. I guess the quill in here. They're beaten. Speaking about this earlier a little bit, but web spitters. Um, I feel like you, it's mostly web. You just get it in your mouth. There's not much meat to it. D tier. They, they taste identical to a spider, and I'm saying it now. Yeah, but they uh, make so much web. Yeah, like a spider. Do you see how small spiders are? You know, they actually cut up uh, tarantulas and eat them in this uh, Vietnam. Oh, yeah. Vietnam. Yeah. So I think they um, taste okay. Uh, the swarmers, unlike the spawn, have lived for longer than spawn because they literally get birthed in front of you. Um, so the swarmers have a lot of a harder shell, uh, and there isn't much meat to them. D tier. Web. But that could be a good thing. They're a lot more nah. crunchy. They may be more like a crisp. They don't go higher than that stroke. They're, they're too, if they're too crunchy, it's not good either. Yeah. That gets between your teeth. That's not good. <laughs> um, ooh, what about wardens? Hmm. I want to try those like sacks. I like, I like the sacks on the side. I want to try those. Of the wardens? Yeah. See, I don't... I, I think, like, the, there just wouldn't be much flavor to them. Like an He's, insect. This man has crisp No, no, they're used eyes. like an insect. They just use the color of the food. <laughs> so, C tier. Insects add quite a bit of, um, like a... A little bit sweet and quite a bit of salt, though. Yeah, but they're, umami. They're perfect then, C tier. I mean, I think that middle gets bumped up a bit if we're, if we're thinking middle, like that. Middle B tier, middle B tier. Yeah. Can this man stop critting? <laughs> no. Don't stop critting. Um, Probably he's crit seven times in a row. I mean, I'm going to move the spitter and the chrono shell back and the youngling shell back to the end as well. Um, because I have a feeling these ones, these ones will place high. Oh, these electric ones? Are, and, uh, low. Uh, very low. Uh, you eat them and you're shot. Yeah, but, yeah, but that... No, no. No, that's why I want them higher up, because I feel like... they remind me of something you eat often, and in bunches, like, uh, a bunch of sh a shrimp. Yeah. I feel like, I feel like you just peel off the outside, and then just and then stuff you... it into your face. Yeah, and a little bit that hurts, that's the piece of shell you're hitting with your finger. S tier. They'd be a good snack. You fry them up, you you peel them and then fry them up and eat them. That's how you that's how you do it. I don't think you peel them. I think you eat the skin. Hmm. What kind of texture would it be? Leathery? Would it be kind of like a fruit, an apple? Uh, Check it, one. Nah. Why have them confused and polished? Uh, still hitting me. Like shrimp. <laughs> They look like they'll taste like shrimp or something, something like seafood. Oh, yes. Um, Alright, what about the Korlok healing pod? Um, honestly, it, 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 it does it look kind of delicious. Not gonna, it, looks like, it, looks like, it looks like some sort of berries, like A grapes or raspberries. Yeah, I, honestly, I think that it could go as a main dish or a side. I, I think feel it's like that minimum mess there. They'd make a, a killer minimum. dessert. Yeah. And let's do yeah, it, I let, agree. Let, let's do it for like uh example. I think a good like a really good fucking uh oh what they call, what the fuck are they called? I had one recently actually. Uh, a creme brulee. Oh yeah. Their insides would be used for the creme brulee and then you would use a uh, uh, red sugar uh, on top and then you harden it. <laughs> um Honestly, I think, I think the rest of the weed is like just, the rest of the I weed that... might be actually disposable and or just used for tea, um, maybe garnish. Tea or broth. Yeah. The next one I think will taste identical to a pea. Can, can I say this one? What the fuck that's called but, now again? But it is a weed. I, I, I think, think, I think like we use it for like... No, 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 no. Uh, a bit of it, uh, the head, a bit of it is used for, uh, uh, to make fucking broths and stocks. Mm, and what what kind of would it be like? A, adding a sweet or kind of kind of a meaty flavor to it. Meaty or umami. Hmm. Let's put that with a Praetorian I think it then. Would be, I think you'd have a nice kick to it too. Honestly, 
with with the uh, main Korok bit, I'm getting Lacketh. nut vibes. I'm getting Lacketh. Like the yeah, like, there's a reason we we break open the shell and we harvest it insides, right? Because because yeah, it's like a, it's like a walnut. Chestnut. Yeah, exactly. I'm I'm thinking A tier. Not quite good though. They are. Yeah, unless you're allergic to them. Yeah. There's no them that feel good. You die for them. I'm getting very sick. Bro, on. you know is that my friend's mom is so. Allergic to nuts. If you open a bag of nuts in the same car, so she'll she'll almost go into an aftermarket shock. <laughs> oh god, that's like, my nuts. Yeah, yeah, it, it is that. It, it is bad. Um. Okay. Well, since we're moving to all of the Macterra at once, let's start with the the normal Macterra spawn. Fire. I forgot the name. Just the Macterra. I think they'd be quite soft. I don't think they'd be mature enough. I think they may be a bit too tender. I, I don't think there'd be enough to them. Mm. I feel like the most most of it you'd be you'd be you'd be ripping out that, that big bulge to yeah. eat. Uh... And kind of I think I think you'd want oh. to get it young and fresh. I oh. think it may be too young. Yeah, no, I see Shadow. Also, I'm happy that I have it's some like, uh, control. Lamb. If it's like I'm Lamb, F there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah we get that if there. If it's Lamb, it's gonna be perfect. I have an F. Shit, forgot that. Did you say S? Yeah, definitely S. Yes. I said F. Definitely S. Yes. Um. Now the Macterra bundles are the ones that have the you know the armor on top of it. Um, honestly, I would imagine it to be a bit tougher, less juicy. Actually, I imagine more tough, but more juicy. Mm. All the oh, sure. when you see when you cook it, all the flavors in that. So you cook it like a chicken, and it keeps all the juices in it so. because it has the nice belly. A little, little bit lower than the McTerra. I, f I forget I forget his I name. I think it'd be the way more juicy, though. Oh, yeah, Shadow, by the way, my Nuzlocke might be ending. Um, ooh. Goodbye, though, hell. GG. Uh, oh, yeah, no. I've gone against shit that crit 24-7. Honestly, the Goo Bomber, I don't get good vibes. And a lot No, more... why didn't you go fighting? He's a good rock mm -hmm. time. Yeah, it did, like, no damage. Because <laughs> the Goo is just okay. sticky. You could make that goo into like an amazing dessert. A pudding. Yeah. Yeah, but how can we be sure you're avoiding this shit? It could just be Repeat. icky, viscous, salty, not useful. How can you be sure? It's sweet. Ah. Maybe no, it's that... then more of a soup. If... Wait, you said it's goop, it's sweet. How like how could you say? Because it, it could it could just be very salty and not good to eat. We have then to you try. make it into a soup. If okay. it's soup. sweet, like a, like we a use slug. it for like a. If we if it's sweet and slug uh, sweet, we can use it for like a pudding or some shit. If it's salty, well, no. you can use it as a broth, a soup. Yeah, but like a lot of flavor. I don't. Of... I would think it's very mucusy, not not. Um... Yeah, no, GG. I'm it. dying here. I don't know, I'm just not getting good vibes from the goo sacks. I just think put it in a, soup, a bit of it in the soup, it probably thickens us up, it adds salt. Oh, it's kind of like um, bird's nest. People add bird's nest to soup. Um, yeah, okay, so I forget which bird it is, but for Chi uh, Chinese, um, you have these birds, and then uh, you rip their nest, so they um, spit out uh, like a lot of saliva, to patch the nest up, uh, and then you harvest that. Yes, exactly. Yeah, no, my my. And it, it's a delicacy because of how hard it is to obtain. Honestly, yeah, mm -hmm. an A tier. Uh, I'm gonna say it now for the next well, one. Moves F tier. Yeah, the grabber. It's literally gonna, a mosquito. He's gonna yeah. hit me before I can do anything. Yeah. Shadow Force. No, 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 Weeb. I'm sorry. I'd rather eat the shit than the mosquito. I there is zero sustenance. Look at look at the teeth on this man. 
You literally, I'd rather eat his teeth than any part of the mosquito. Even his poop. Hmm. What about the tri jaw? Uh, I imagine the only part that's edible is the little yellow part. No, yeah. I'm getting confused. I'm getting confused. I, t I talked to you about a different anime. Um, I imagine Famous Nakira, only probably a bit older, a bit. The meat will have more of a mature flavor, but slightly more chewy. It's kind of just there. No, you got okay. this. Yeah. But, another, but you got Ooh. no. It's another Pokemon. Okay. And then we also have the double fight. And I where does the breeder sword. lay? No, run away. Okay, wait. And first of all, you have to think. It has a delicacy in its belly. It has eggs, like caviar. So yes. It has caviar. It has a lot of meat. Honestly, it may be the tuna of that world. But like it, it just seems like that that back bit is mostly for it to float about. I would agree, but I would. There's definitely going to be some just small areas. Like there's not going to be a lot of meat off it, surprisingly. But there's going to be small areas of just delicious meat, very juicy, not chewy. I would imagine mm. its tentacles would be nice. I imagine his, its true. mouth would be a bit chewy. It's always getting used. And it has caviar. That's fair. We... Uh, and the... Yeah? Here you go. And the little babies, I think they fall a little bit behind. Uh, it depends. Do you want the spike? Do you want... Do you want them... Do, these ones wouldn't have as much of a shock in flavour. But I would imagine they'd be juice. They'd be a lot less Chewy than the uh, adult farm one. I feel like yeah, there would be less flavor though because they they literally were just born. Some places, the younger the better. The meat will be way less, way more tender. Hmm. And maybe they don't. They're such a small animal. Maybe they don't need time to accumulate extra flavor. Maybe. maybe. You Granted, look. they don't have caviar. Um, okay, what about the brood nexus then? It's I... either going to be the worst thing you ever tasted, or shockingly good. I think it's going to be really hard, tough, lean meat, very leathery on the outside. But then its eyes will... Honestly, the eyes will maybe its eyes look No. <laughs> no. Mm -hmm. A bit above the, Honestly, above the yeah. grabber. I'll move grabber down a little bit, actually. I agree. Honestly, I'm just going to say the spider should be above the brood nexus. Ah. Stab a vine. I imagine the only thing that's edible is the yellow part. Um, I do the not imagine is... it's edible, actually. It's just looks yeah. very tough. I think you use that rough. just for stock, nothing else. Yeah, I would imagine you only use... Granted, maybe the... Yeah, red pot you can use to barn to infuse flavor. So maybe it's good for barning. Yeah, okay. I'm still going to say that's above the mosquito. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sure. Let's put. Nah, I think the mosquito should be at the bottom. I agree. It should be at um, the bottom. All right, let's move this thing tail over. I have a feeling we'll end up discussing it to be high. What about the sand shark? The Nayaka Trolla. I imagine it tastes exactly like a shark. Apparently they're not great. Um, I imagine the the yellow pit would be very juicy and nice. Also, I like, kind yeah, of I, think it's beefy. I think, right, that, that, that b belly side is very fatty because the rest of it is just pure muscle. Yeah. And so I it needs think... that fat. Yeah. To, I you think... know, dig through the sand and rip up dwarves. Right? Yeah. I kind of think theta. So I I think that fat would actually end up being really nice in, like, uh, stocks and stuff. So, yeah, C. High, high C. I, I think one below. Really? Hmm. I think those babes might as well be nicer. Okay, the Betsy Xenocharge suckers. I imagine 
it's either going to be unedible or very small but very flavorsome. Honestly, they don't do much on Betsy. <laughs> so mm-hmm. there's, there's no there's no attributes to it. Yeah. I I don't I don't think there's much of anything to it. Inedible. Yeah, Inedible I can't. Tier. That that's fair. Uh let's do let's do the normal glyphid dreadnought. Uh I I don't know why I keep getting viewers on this stream. Honestly, I think all the dreadnoughts are low. They're old, they exercise a ton. I imagine they all have very tough meat. But I'd imagine their weak spots are probably very chewy. Very, not chewy, very delicious. I imagine like, that's the only thing to them. The quick spots. That's the only good part to eat. It's like, you know, you people eat, you know, alligators, eat bears. Like, people people eat yeah, apex I think predators. You, I think you referenced a, 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 a dreadnought with an alligator. If it's not cooked right, it's it is uh, tough and it's not doesn't taste good. But if cooked right, it's really tender and good. Look, I, what I'm saying is, I think it'll have those quick spots that are delicious, but I think the meat overall will be stewing meat. Mm-hmm. The gl- dreadnought itself is giving really high tier vibes. Maybe be. above the crashes. Uh, fuck it. Let's do the hive guard. Um, which one is this one? The one that summons babies. Okay. Now, are the babies incorporated with him? Sure, we can include the babies with it. Okay, he automatically gets put up one rank for death for attacking. The babies are basically extra, like chicken wings. Extra yeah, but they size. explode into literal flaming goop. So they have a popping flavor. It's like that pop candy. So when yeah. you get it in your mouth, it, uh, you know the pops. <laughs> that sounds really nice, Weeb. That, okay, that is that is that is just almost almost McTerra. Oh, that's what it's called, McTerra Brundle. Honestly, they. It doesn't he have a. Also, with a quick spot, I think he may be an S tier. Just like genuinely. That's fair. What about the twins? So Fabulous have... and uh, Lacerator. You have double the amount of. Hmm. I'm not sure. I, they're either going to be a bit higher than the fast red knot or low. I feel like they're a bit lower than the Dreadnought. Yeah, I just think both of them individually will have less flavor. Like, probably around here even. Uh, uh, one, one down. Yes. Hmm. What about the Oppressors? Um, Oppressor. I kind of think it would just be an older version of... What was the other one called? The Praetorians. Yeah, I think it would be an older version of the Praetorian. Honestly? No. So I'd imagine more tough. I'm thinking there's less meat, and the meat that you do get just isn't as good. Like, you'd mostly be using it for um, armor. Armor, weapons. For the Praetorian, for the Guardian, or the Warden? The I agree Oppressors. The warden. Yeah. I'm, I'm getting confused with names. <laughs> <laughs> Um, what about yeah, the spit ballers? Yeah, I, I think high. Yeah, I'm thinking high. Maybe. I think it has that little gooey pit, which I think may be like sap. Yeah. I, I think that'd be like sap, the thing in its thing. It, it has a the nice thing acid, thing. which I think we could add spice. And so I kind of think it'd be really nice. I wouldn't imagine that as a main dish, but I imagine it can boost everything up by like one or two divisions. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> uh, of these three, who 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 will be next? The baby. Yeah, Corona, Youngling, Shellback. 
I think the youngling has just the right amount of age that it isn't it hasn't developed as tough and meat. But still nice because I don't imagine the quick spot at the end would actually be that great. So granted, it does have an acid attack, which is a sauce. So it does come with a self sauce. But I don't I think you'd want to be eating that acid. Yeah. <laughs> I well no, think about it. It it may you may be able to use it to tenderize other meat or imbue flavour. You can use pineapple, that tenderizes meat. <clears throat> Doesn't that destroy meat? Um, but for the youngling... If you live it too long, yes. Um, I think just above think... the trawler. Which is uh, that? C-tier. Yeah. To be like honest, I think it's... Like peeling a yeah. shrimp. I have a lot of things to say about the stinger. Okay. Uh, uh, the go. Corona shellback. Um, like the guard... Well. Um, giving lobster no, vibes. I, I survived. So only with one. I actually think lower. I think its meat has got a lot more tough, and the acid has probably got stronger. The thing is, seafood doesn't get that tough. <laughs> yeah, but isn't the youngling just a baby version of the old one? Yeah, depends. So if that means shark, the young one is a. If it's a shark, yes. Stick tail. It's either going to taste like lobster or a. What's that thing called again? Scorpion. People do eat so, scorpions. Uh, do you have... I hear they're very yeah. good. For uh, you got this. I've got three Pokemans. I'm thinking... The dual battle is only against two Pokemon. Oh, they yeah. Them? Well, I'm these things the are S-tier. useless. Once you get past all of that... Well, there we go. Yes. I also think the thing at the head is going to be all. the juiciest meat out of all of these. Oh yeah. Once you get past all that exterior, you know the armor on their head and the mm-hmm. tusks, you get you get incredibly juicy sweet meat that you could what? just eat fresh. Yeah. Oh no, I think this one would need to be cooked. Shadow, what do you think about this one? Oh well, yeah, and its tail. I think it's oh, tail it's the thing. Be, yeah. I think the stinger's meat is gonna be really like sweet on the sweeter end but if and the stinger is going to be great for specifically uh broth sauce soup uh, can i also say something uh, i think it's less it's meat and more it's tail it's the tail i, I think just... the tail is going to be like a lobster honestly no no i don't think there's going to be a lot of meat on the tail but i think you could use that for broth i think it's i think yeah like shut you're going to have a lot of hard Sweet, juicy meat, like a lobster tail. Because lob- lobsters use those tails like hell. See, I don't think there'll actually be too much meat on it. I think you have the you meat seen how thick their tails are. I think it's mainly for the the, the the stinger. Like they can grapple people twenty feet away. Yeah, Most exactly. Because how be empty. Firm has to grab. Like all that meat is very tough, and but juicy. It's gonna be like a lobster tail. It works a lot, but it's still gonna be really good. The smoothie crashes down a bit. I don't feel like it I should be that high. I About there. You, fall. you go down the stairs. So I think if I don't think it has enough for F S to I think for F there? I believe I guess, oh, like wow. around here. Uh, here. Mm-hmm. Okay. I feel comfortable with this tier list. Wait a second. I feel like we're forgetting something. Well, I believe in you. Where to go? I don't see elves on this list. (laughs) 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 Honestly, loot bugs and elves aren't here. Um, They should be. Um, I think loot bugs will be lower than the crashes because they they, they just eat minerals. I I think loot bugs are either going to be FF tier or inedible. Like no in between. No in Yeah. Between. Like if you tried to eat it, you would have this grainy meat. To be fair, wait, canonically dwarf you eat rock. So I think it's gonna be FF tear for dwarf. <laughs> F- loot bugs are FF tear for dwarf. For humans probably inedible. This this would be for human consumption. Inedible. <laughs> inedible. Tastes like chicken. <laughs> The wolf probably tastes like chicken, so S tier. I mean elves. I misspoke. 
elves, SS tier. Um, you should kill them and eat them at, at all costs in front of their family. Beautiful. Um, if you are a dwarf, if you are not a dwarf, then they're probably kind of, kind of B or C tier. Decent meat, decent juice. <laughs> Good at running away. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Full tier list. Um. Well, that is it. Uh, I guess this vod will be saved to my Twitch permanently forever. Um. I have no more reason to stream, so I should. Why? Why are people joining when I'm finishing the tier list? My tier list is done. <laughs> um. Yep. It's this... so you continue. That, that <laughs> well, you what continue is that to tier? What is that to tier? Why am I getting raided, <laughs> bro? <laughs> we definitely uh, meant to continue. Th thank you for the raid. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. Um, I absolutely do mind you dropping it because um, I have finished my tier list uh, and was actually planning to send some people uh, on their journey across Twitch. Um, now we have more people to send on the journey. Yeah. I mean, precisely. Yeah. <laughs>